Oof. All right. We're about a about an hour and a half in. Just doing a quick stop. I'm gonna check on the bikes, see how the little parts are doing. Gotta check the bolts, make sure the back is on okay. And uh, yeah, keep going. Hour and a half in, about another probably two hours to the ferry. And then uh, we'll go to Foucault. I'm pretty exhausted today. Only got about five hours of sleep. So uh, we're running a little low, but everything, uh, everything works great on the bike today. Let's check it out here. Just gotta make sure those bolts are okay. They feel all right, they look all right. They're still in there. Uh, everything else is okay. I burnt my leg a couple times on this exhaust. That's not a lot of fun, but everything's looking all right. We'll check the gas and then we'll get back on the road and uh, we keep going. We made it to the ferry, but there was a problem with the one that we booked at 1.30. So uh, they're unloading it right now, but there's a problem with it, so we're gonna have to catch the one at 3.30. And it's crazy how they're unloading the motorbikes. I'm, uh, we're a bit worried about my bike that they're loading on, but I mean, they're professionals, but they're just doing it on a plank of wood. That's all that they're using to unload the bikes. A plank of wood and four guys. But yeah, I guess you gotta trust the system. So I had a chance to have some lunch with um this one local kid, and he just got married, 24. And he was telling me a little bit about his work and uh, what he's doing. He works 12 hours a day, seven days a week, all year round, for 10,000, uh, or sorry, 10 million Viet Dong uh, per month, which is like, maybe like 450 bucks, um, which is crazy for the amount of work he's doing. Um, and at the, at the end of our meal, he was trying to pay for my meal. Um, yeah, and he just got married too. It, it's it's wild out here, but the the people here are way too generous for what they have. It's it's really touching. It's really uh, it's I don't know how to describe it besides that. But he's just over here. If he ever watches this, I wish you good luck with your marriage and good health. Here. They're loading 
loading up the bike. We arrived here in uh, Phu Quoc. Um, staying at a hostel here in Phu Quoc. Really, really nice. It was a long day. 260 kilometers, I think, was the, the total count. Um, I, just, I can't reiterate how nice the Vietnamese people are. You know, the Kia I met on the ferry, super nice. It, it feels like when you're, you know, riding a motorbike, you get the true, you know, local experience. You almost get treated like a local. Everyone's really nice to you, everyone's really kind. Um, just you know wanting to spend time that he rode almost all the way with me uh, after the ferry to the hostel But he had to go his own way. It's just a really good experience uh, But I'm gonna go get some food gonna relax get some good sleep tonight and explore uh, Fukok tomorrow